Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new, my name is Lauren. Today is Friday, I got home from work about an hour ago and then um, I quickly got ready, put on some really light makeup. I took off my work makeup and then put on just a really light layer of some tinted moisturizer and then just some mascara and, <coughs> bless you, and eyebrows. And we are going to dinner with Maya and Jake, and um, we're going to this ramen pokey restaurant that we've never been to, but they say it's really good. They went a few weeks ago. So we're about to leave, and um, yeah, I just wanted to start off this vlog. grande um double shot of espresso with pumpkin cream cold foam on top no that's it all right what's your name lauren, lauren okay thank you thank you good morning you guys it is the next day i just got my starbucks grande double shot of espresso with pumpkin cream cold foam on top i don't add anything to the espresso I mean you can probably add milk or like pumps of stuff to make it more flavorful for you but honestly I just feel like the pumpkin cream like once it starts to drip down into the espresso it's amazing on its own I say that but I'm also the type of person that can drink things that are black or unflavored or like taste really strong because I've trained myself to be able to drink stuff like that when I first started drinking coffee I was drinking caramel macchiatos and vanilla lattes with extra pumps of vanilla you know so i was always the one that was just like adding a ton of i mean i feel like a lot of people are like that when they first start drinking coffee i mean no one starts drinking coffee just drinking it black like that's nuts i feel like you slowly like work down to that so um yeah i've trained myself to be able to drink black coffee or like with a splash of almond milk and no sweetener and I think it tastes the best and you don't always necessarily need all that sugar but the fall time drinks and the winter time drinks are the exceptions I make because the fall drinks and the winter drinks are just the best drinks but anyways I also I don't know why I got this a lot of people aren't going into the Starbucks store anymore they started displaying their reusable cups outside and I got one and I don't know why I got it. I just saw it outside and I was like, 99 cents. Ooh, can I have that one? So I got a reusable cup. I thought it was more fall-like. Is that like a fall leaf? I don't know. And now it looks kind of summery a little. But is that a fall leaf? Like, are these fall leaves? I don't know. But I got a reusable cup. I don't know why I got the reusable cup, but I did. Anyways, yeah, so I got my little 99 cent cup. They really get you now with putting it in the drive-thru. Like, there was a ton of other ones, too, that were meant for, like, iced coffees. But I saw it, and I was like, 99 cents. I have to have it. I don't even know if I'm going to use it. It's not. I never take my coffee to go, but maybe I'll, I will one day. I don't know. Okay, I'm just cooking these, what are these called? Hash browns from Trader Joe's in the air fryer. And I cook everything in this air fryer. If you don't have an air fryer, you need one. I just checked on Amazon and it's on sale for $89, the instant one that we have. And it's the best thing I've ever bought. I cook, I haven't tried cooking actual chicken breasts in here but I've cooked like the orange chicken frozen food from Trader Joe's I cook broccoli in here Brussels sprouts vegetables french fries hash browns everything 
and it's so good so I'll link it down below from Amazon and you can also find it in my Amazon shop I just added a bunch of stuff to it earlier today so definitely check it out if you don't have one already okay so I'm just editing my work week of my life vlog there's 121 clips I just counted it these videos take me so long to edit because it's five days worth of videos it's just a lot but um, I'm only on Monday <laughs> it's 240 something and I'm kind of hungry so I'm gonna make these it's kind of weird you just put them in the oven they're from Trader Joe's they're mini chicken tacos they only have the shell and the chicken so you kind of add your own toppings to it okay so here's our little snack or I guess lunch um, so it's just like a build your own taco plate so the little tacos already come with chicken inside but it's actually really good and it has some flavor too and then you can just add the toppings that you want because it only comes with the shell and the chicken in it so just like a little create your own taco plate as a snack or lunch so <laughs> bless you every time i start a clip you're sneezing just some mascara and <laughs> bless you and eyebrow <laughs> bless you so it's a lot later it is seven o'clock i've been sitting right there for four and a half hours editing my work week and my life vlog it's taken me like a total of almost six hours to edit the video it's it just takes so long there were so many clips but and I'm still not done so but the UCF game is on at 7 30 and we're in the process of ordering pizza from Pizza Hut. We both like Pizza Hut's deep dish pizza. It's really good and that's what we're doing for dinner. I'm sitting in the car. Christian just ran inside because he's impatient because he came with me to get the pizza uh, that we ordered from Pizza Hut. Um, I look like I'm suffocating myself. Um, I'm wearing like a huge sweatshirt because the game is at 7.30 and it's 7.20 and he's like, the email is contactless pickup and they bring out the um, pizza to you. So I was like, I think you just wait in your car and you click the email. The email has like a button to click that says I'm here. And he was like, I can't wait. We, we have to be back. We have to be back. And he gets out of the car and goes inside because he's impatient. But I understand. We're both UCF alumni, if you didn't know. We both graduated a few years ago so and he used to work for the UCF football team so he's like a hardcore UCF football fan and he loves the games doesn't like to miss them yeah so I'm repping my college team tonight I thought I'd put on like a big sweatshirt because it's kind of rainy and gross outside but yeah that's what's going on I'm super excited to eat pizza I love deep dish pizza from Pizza Hut I feel like a lot of people hate on Pizza Hut, but I think it's delicious. I think their deep dish pizza is so good. Uh, when I went to Chicago, this was one of my first vlogs ever, but when I went to Chicago with Maya and Taylor, I posted three different vlogs, and um, we tried the Chicago deep dish pizza. So good, so good. Didn't really vlog much today, but I've literally been locked in to a computer screen, basically doing my second job. <laughs> <laughs> which is YouTube um, on the weekend so constantly just go 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 but I love it okay now we got to rush back okay we got the pizza this is the best for our coke this glass right here this is so good right now with not only Lake but an old miss can't have a slice of pizza without. I get to drink another Mountain Dew. That was how they started against East Carolina. Four straight calls before they took a snap. And then
Hi you guys, it's the next day. I am currently on my way to go to Target to get some groceries, but I wanna make this meatball slider dish today. And um, Christian wants banana bread, so I just need like two ingredients for the banana bread. One thing that I'm super excited about, if you remember a few vlogs ago, I got this it's almost gone now this scarecrow crunch granola and it had those chocolate covered cereal squares in the granola mix what is this cereal square oh my gosh these are so good and I was obsessed with those. I mean, they're already all gone out of here. And I didn't know that you could buy those separately. Christian told me that you could buy them separately and I found them. They're Chex Mix Money Buddies. And they're the peanut butter and chocolate flavored. I don't know if that's exactly the same as those, but they're my favorite thing in they're not exactly like mm -mm, the other ones were softer they weren't as crunchy I mean they're still really good and you can even easily make these there's like a ton of recipes online they're so good though so yeah that's the one thing that I was really excited about at Target to get. I was like looking all over the store for these. What are you doing, babe? So I'm making lemon water. banana bread is finished it smells so good I was telling Christian that I wish there was a candle that smelled like this banana bread because it smells so good and now I'm about to start cooking the meatball sliders um, so you need oil sauce little rolls 12 of them and then I did turkey meatballs just gonna cook them really quick. I mean, they're already fully cooked, so I guess I'm just gonna heat them up really quick. And mozzarella, Parmesan, and then Italian seasoning. And that's it, I think. I have to look at the recipe. And let's see, where's the picture? Hopefully that's what ours looks like in the end. I also forgot to share before I started eating it, but we also paired the sliders with a salad, with a salad kit that I got from Target today. And also the sliders are good, really good. I like them.